Yo, what's happening, everybody? My name is Dan Tanner, and welcome to Tanner So Lit. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You read the title? Yes, indeed. We're about to unbox this Galaxy A52 5G from Xfinity Mobile. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And people, shout out to Xfinity Mobile. They've been a sponsor to my channel for the last two years, and I really appreciate them. But just know, they didn't send me this phone for free. I bought this with my hard-earned money and all that. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Man, oh, man, oh, man. So anytime you super chat or whatever or send me a PayPal or Cash App donation, all the money goes back into the channel. And people, in my previous video, I unboxed this Galaxy A32 5G from Metro PCS. And my unboxing experience with this phone was pretty lit. But man, let me tell you about the A series and my channel. The A50 won my phone of the year two years ago. I skipped the 51, I don't know why. Big John got it and he loved the A51. So now this year, I'm on this A52 to see what's up. So enough of me yapping. Hey yo, it's time to start unpacking. Let's go. Okay, so inside the box was this box right here. This box right here was hiding. It was clinging to the top of the box like Spider-Man or something. Yes, indeed. And inside this box right here, you got a pamphlet and everything. Well, a couple of them. You know what I'm saying? With the quick reference guide in terms of conditions. Then on the other side of the box, you got your SIM injection tool. Also inside the box was this boy right here. Yes, indeed. Man, y'all see that lightning bolt right there? Fast charger brick on deck, no question. You see that apple? That's what I'm talking about. And also your USB-C power cord. And finally in the box, the star of the show, the Galaxy A52. Yes, sir, yes, sir. Let's unwrap it live. Listen for the sound. I guess that sounded all right. Let's take a tour. On the bottom of the phone, you got your headphone jack, USB-C port, noise canceling microphone, and speaker. On the right side of the phone, you got your power button right there and your volume rocker. Both buttons are slightly raised, but not by too much. On the top, you got a noise canceling microphone right there and your SIM card tray. The left side is bare because there's nothing there, but as far as the back goes, the build quality and feng shui is matte plastic. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You got a four camera setup on the back with the flash. Yeah! The camera hump ain't raised too much. This is pretty good. No question about it. Got the Samsung logo tastefully put. And people, despite this being a matte case, sometimes it might attract a couple of fingerprints, but nothing too crazy. Like his younger brother right here. <laughs> As you can see, the A32 got the shiny back. Y'all see that big old fingerprint right there? Ugh. But the back of this A52 5G, man, I really like it. You know what I'm saying? I love the matte finish. It feels kind of premium. As far as the screen goes, nice big screen. The same size as the A32. Let me go ahead and pull it on out. That's what she said. These phones, as far as the screen size, are pretty much the same in everything. So, man, I think this is OLED. I'm gonna go ahead and confirm that later in this video as I look up the specs and everything, but as you can see, you got the dot right there at the top, which is the front facing camera. Yes, sir, yes, sir. Now let's go ahead and check out the software and such. Okay. Well, as you can see, I migrated all my info from my A32 to my A52, you know what I'm saying, using a smart switch. Happened very quickly, man. <sighs> Love the setup. Okay, okay, well, I got the phone set up to where we can go through the UI and experience the feel of it and all that. Swipe right here. Okay, pretty fast, pretty accurate. Of course, this is the honeymoon phase of a phone. Man, oh man, oh man. Pretty lit, not bad. And one thing about the brightness of the screen, this screen right here is very, very bright. Check this out. Look, I got the levels almost all the way down on screen brightness. Huh, absolutely lit, no question about it. And people dig this. This feature right here is in a mid-range phone. Always on display. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. The A32 don't have it. Huh. But on this A52 5G, man, you can make it do what it do. Believe that. Okay, now I got the camera app open. Let's take a tour. At the top, got the settings wheel right there. The flash. Got the timer right there. Aspect ratio. 
What is this right here? Let's click on that icon right there. Motion photo on, you click on that. That means if you go ahead and take a picture while you're moving and everything, whenever somebody views it, it moves a little bit, you know, like on iPhones and everything. Turn that off for a minute. And then also right here, there's one right there. You got the filters and everything, yes sir, for the feng shui's and all that, if you want to use it. Then at the bottom of the interface right there, you got the gallery app, you got the trigger right there, then you got the, the wheel right there that goes from front to back camera and everything. Yes sir, yes sir. Then as far as the modes, you got photo mode, single take mode. Yes sir, yes sir. It says, welcome to the single take mode where your camera automatically captures a wide variety of pics and clips from any scene. What? So say okay. Then you got the phone right there. And people, I still ain't got to this yet. I want 832, but trust me, I'm gonna dig in and get it for you, you know what I'm saying? Because I definitely wanna see what this fun mode is all about. Then also, you got video mode right there. Yes sir, yes sir. And at the top of the video mode, you got a couple of more icons at the top of the menu. You got the gesture and everything, just in case you wanna take the picture with your hands open and close it or whatever. Then you got the FHD, yes indeed. So you can go ahead and change the size and speed of your video. And then as far as the more button go right here, yes sir, let's press on that and see what's up. You get AR Doodle, Pro Mode, yes sir, yes sir. Panorama, food for the foodies. Night Mode for low light situations. Macro, yeah. Then you got Portrait Mode, Pro Video Mode. Oh my, y'all know I'm gonna explore that. Super Slow Mode, Slow Motion, and Hyperlapse. Decent, decent, decent options. And then as far as the notification shade, let's take a look. Man, oh man, pull it down second time. You get all the options that I use for sure every day and probably some that you would like too. So man, as far as the shade go, it's official. Now, as far as the options or ways to get in the phone, you get more than one. You got face unlock, then you get the under display fingerprint sensor, which sometimes I lose. That's just me, I'd rather have a fingerprint sensor like on this A32 that's built in, that's physical, or something on the back. And also you can use your password on here. Okay, hold up, wait a minute. Samsung did make it hella easy to find the under display fingerprint sensor, let me show you. Icon right on the button, bam, no problem. So let's close again. Let's lock it, unlock, fingerprint sensor. Okay, it works pretty good. And people, as far as the feel in the hand, I love it. No question about it, for a bigger phone, it's really slim. Compared to the A32, yes indeed, the A32 is probably almost, man, a quarter of a gram or inch or whatever the hell they call it, just, just way thicker than an A52 right here. So as far as the build form factor and the design language, man, this gets an A+. Well, as far as the price of the phone, <clears throat> on Xfinity Mobile, it's around 450, you know what I'm saying? So that's like $20 a month, $21 a month or so like that, which is pretty cool. And also to let you guys know who don't have Xfinity Mobile or anything like that, but are interested in getting this A52, don't worry. Your carrier also carries this phone. So man, you can definitely get your hands on it. Well, all right, everybody, that just about does it for this one. So if you like what you saw and like what you heard, please give your guy and Samsung a thumbs up because that's official. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. But if you have not yet subscribed to my channel to feel the whole drip and madness of Dan Tanner and Team Lit, then people do that too because that's official too. All right, everybody. Get money. Get respect. And enjoy your tech. Be easy.